So I'm in my uh, my loft, man, and I wanted to, you know, make this a part of the vlog. I wanted to bring you guys some some information, and not only information, but some wisdom and some perspective, right? So like, you know, I'm building this e-commerce business, this store. I'm doing a whole bunch of research and stuff like that, right? And I do a lot of research. And so within that process, I'm studying people. I'm studying different businesses, different business models and things like that. I'm on these different forums and stuff. So I had a conversation with a friend uh, not too long ago, and it really just like brought up a whole bunch of stuff. So I asked him, I said, yo, because he already has a, a e-commerce business, right? He sells luxury watches. And so we're talking and I'm like, hey man, I was like, yo bro, how do you handle, you know, seeing somebody else like, you know, having massive success, maybe in a shorter time frame than you or not? Because I know that a whole bunch of entrepreneurs struggle with this thing. You may not say it, but you know, you struggle with it or people may not say it, but they do struggle with it. So he was like, yo, I'm gonna tell you some real life stuff. And I was like, what's up? He was like, you just have to not give a fuck. That's it, because this is the thing. How can you win your race when you're looking at the people that you're racing, right? If you're running, right, and you're looking to the left or to the right, you're gonna miss out what's ahead of you. There may be something that you need to hurdle over or jump over, but if you're looking to the right or the left of you, i.e. your competition, then how are you gonna succeed? And then also, Let's say you sell, let's say you sell, um, you know, shoes, some kind of shoes. And so you see somebody else who may have, you know, shoes similar to what you're going to be selling or what you're selling. And then let's say they did, you know, $40 million this year. You still can't be mad at that because you don't know. They may be making room for your products. And they be making room. They may be making room for you to do eighty million dollars, as opposed to forty million of what they did. You just never know. You just have to focus. If you lock in on what you have to do, if you lock in on your goals, on your dreams, and you just go after it, then you gonna be good, man. And another thing that I learned is. Have the big goal in mind, know what you want to accomplish, but inside of that, under that, you need to know what you need to accomplish on a day-to-day -day basis, on a small steps level, right? You need to know the little things that it's going to take to get where you really want to go. These are things that if you want to be successful, if you want to be anything worth anything in this world, in this life, you have to learn these things. You have to master these things. So like, stop looking outside of everybody. You have your life to worry about. You don't have anybody else's life to worry about. Your journey is your journey. Your path is your path. Just because somebody else made $20 million, $8 million, who cares? You may be on a road to make $800 million, but it's just going to come a little bit later. Stop focusing on everybody else. Focus on yourself. Focus on your life, right? Focus on your journey. That's it. Stop looking at everybody else and think that you're lacking. Stop not wanting other people to be successful because you're not successful or you don't feel like you're successful. These are just thoughts that I be thinking on a day to day, right? When I'm on, at the computer or I'm out driving or something like that, right? I'm on the way to a meeting, whatever it is. These are things that I be thinking about and I may call one of my homeboys to talk about it you know, or to talk through it or to gain perspective or we may go somewhere to mastermind. But this, these are the things. This is what they don't teach you in books. Entrepreneurship is about adjusting on the fly. Entrepreneurship is about taking a step back so you can take two steps forward. 
Entrepreneurship is all these different things mixed inside of this one thing that nobody can explain. But we all try to make the best explanation of it. Right? So, like, I say to you, man, focus on your own thing. Focus on your own thing. If you can focus on your own thing, you'll be a lot happier. And I mean that. You won't be as bothered. Delete social media, man. Get off social media. It's toxic to you. Stop looking at other people's lives thinking you good or, or you're lacking or you, you know, you need to do X, Y, and Z. You know what you need to do? More of what you're already doing. Do it more intensely. That's what you need to do. And I know this for a fact, man. So that's what I wanted to say. Suave eyewear coming soon. It's coming soon. I'm not in a rush to fail. I am taking the, 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 the time that it, I need to, to, you know, handle things how they need to be. I'm not rushing nothing. I'm not in nobody's rush because I know my plan. So, you know, this is the vlog. This is the journey. So I hope you continue to follow along. If you want to uh, follow me on IG, Instagram, uh, follow me at Mr. Starts with the Vision. That's M-R. S-T-A-R-T-S-W-I-T-H-A-V-I-S-I-O-N or, you know, follow this journey and I'll put the link right here and I'm going to holler at you guys later but more of these YouTube videos coming soon. Comment, like, share, subscribe, whatever, man.